Shavak uh, letting it rip at the Australian captain, who's the new batsman. This is Tanvir again. And that's beautifully played as well. Michael Clark, when he, uh, when he gets it right, he looks so unrushed. Just watch this replay. He's got enough time to knit a jumper, hasn't he? Beautiful shot. And this is why sometimes it's good to bat in the top order where the ball's nice and new, comes onto the bat. You let the ball absorb into your body, flick it, and let the hard ball just let it sail away to the boundary. Into the gap again. That's another uh, attribute that uh, good batsmen have. When you nudge it away, instead of nudging it straight to a fielder, you get it into the gap. Oh, and well bowled. Oh boy, a lot of angle on that one. As you can imagine, left arm round the wicket. Clark uh, didn't pick the line on that occasion. That's a lovely straight drive. He beats the field. Beautifully crafted straight drive from Michael Clark. He looks so good when he's driving the ball in that fashion. He's always looking to get forward. So if you're at all slightly full, he's going to drive you easily because that's his favourite area, is to get on the front foot, drive straight. Again, you see, my view is he's coming forward all the time that mid off mid on should be quite straight. It's almost like when you're bowling at Sachin Tendulkar, your mid on has to be very straight because that's where he takes it from middle and off off stump and hits it very straight past the wickets at the other end. Shorter and finds the gap to the offside. This is glorious batting from Michael Clark. The ball runs away from the fielders, ends the over on a high. He's quite ag agitated there was the captain. He obviously got a plan. And uh, Tamir didn't execute it there. I think I think he's possibly saying to give him too much width. Brilliantly done. Michael Clark with a fantastic drive. 50 comes up as a result of that smashing drive to the offside. What good use of the feet. Got there in no time and hit it extremely hard into the gap. the gap again nicely played all the way along the ground clock looking good it's these boundaries that just take the pressure off looking for an lbw yasser arafat swung the ball back in uh, to michael clark's pad and uh, up for it uh, was him timed it nicely it was always a four uh, as he left the bat so that has got the ball again going on the up through the offside that's a great start well, that'll um, just rock his confidence a little bit. Very well played by Clark. He means business, doesn't he? A lot easier, easy to face him now. Look at that, right on top of the ball. And, uh, beautifully timed. That's well played again through the gap, and that'll go to the boundary as well. Well, that's the Aussies' best over so far. I don't need to many, many more like this. Show back to her. This has not been a good over for him. Four, then a no ball, one, one. A dot ball and another four. That's a poor delivery. Plenty of room there for uh, Michael Clark. And uh, against on the up. Well, ball. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Gets a single on the offside. Now, if he had the mid-off on up then, and that's his 50. Well played. Really good knock, Michael Clark. Under all sorts of pressure coming in at... Uh, at, uh, when they were three, they lost their second wicket, but it's his fourth 50 against Pakistan. Oh, down the pitch and smashes it through, extra cover. What a beautiful shot. Good use of the feet. Well, I was always taught that if things aren't going for you in the field, you've got to change the bowling, haven't you? You've got to give the batsman something different, because Michael Clark's playing wonderfully well. Oh, and that was close to leg stump. Oh, and another misfield. Good delivery, first up. He's gone through again through the offside. Another quality of his uh, innings is uh, his ability to find the gaps. 150 comes up as a result of that thunderous blow through the offside. Well, I think there's a little despondency by some of the Pakistan players because 
quite honestly, they don't know how to get through Clark. I mean, you're just giving yourself a little bit of room with super confidence. Off drive, pierce the field. Field of almost 100. Slow delivery, that's gone over mid-off for four. He's so quick to read them, Michael Clark. The slow delivery was picked up early and he had uh, the zone in his mind to go over the top. Well, it's been uh, symptomatic of his innings. Saw it quickly. Clean, crisp strike over the top. Uh, he's not made any mistakes at all. Oh, inside out. Magnificent shot onto 94. This is the best one day knock I've ever seen him play. Under extreme pressure. Now, uh, three for two. And he's come out and played beautifully. What a one sided affair. Beautiful shot, no doubt about it. Uh, right on, on top of it. Uh, used his feet, although he's getting cramped up. But They'll be looking for two. Now he's one hit away. Now that's a good position for a batsman. <laughs> that hasn't happened, has it? Oh, magnificent, that'll be it. Oh, yes, what a knock, Michael Clark. Brilliant knock. He's fourth one day in the National 100. Second against Pakistan. First as test uh, as a one day in the National captain. Gives it a kiss. And this will be his eighth win as a captain out of ten matches. What a knock. What a knock indeed. That's 196 for two. Well, he smashed that one. It was a full length delivery and a water hit. That was the best way you can get to your 100. Through the cover, right from the screws. Look at that. That is a well deserved 100. Superb knock of 122 delivery with 14 boundaries. Captain himself taking the charge. What a knock.